Fife Flyers TV, sponsored by the Bay Hotel, Fife's premier wedding venue. Jeff, that's got to be a much better feeling coming in here after a win like that. Yeah, I think um, I think it's a continuation of last night. I think you know we went into Nottingham and right from the you know, opening face off, I think we you know five on five, in the, you know in the, in the 120 minutes this weekend, I thought we were fantastic. I thought we controlled a lot of the zone time. Um, you know, there's still areas of our game that we want to clean up. I think we um, you know. It's good to see the power play click tonight. Um, you know, last night we got two looks at the power play. I, I just didn't think that we executed very well. Um, but five on five, like I can't, you know, say, you know, so much about what we did. Um, you know, we just controlled the play, and I think when you do that early on, it just it kind of creates a momentum. And I think tonight we carried that through. And uh, again, I was really happy for the guys because you know to get a lead and. You know, to see how the, the the fans react to you know a team that's working that hard, um, you know now they know um, what the standard is and, and you know what the fans expect. And um, being full tonight obviously is a, is a huge boost to us. And um, yeah, just overly yeah happy with the performance. You don't win games in the first periods. Um, were you concerned coming off the ice that having that big lead might have led to guys kind of take the foot off the gas? No, I think we we try to manage that in the in between periods. So we try to um, you know we use the the phrase reset uh, a lot. Um, you know, never get you know too high, too low. Um, so I, again, we we warned that there might be a pushback, so we need to be prepared. And I thought we handled it well. I thought you know we we came out with the same intensity and drive um, you know five on five in the second period which then you know we widened the gap further um, probably a little bit disappointed on, on you know giving up that power play goal um, but all in all um, you know can't fault the effort can't fault the compete and uh, you know hopefully this is the turnaround for us um, going forward nice mix of scorers as well and, and including your d-men and over the summer, you always talk about the fact that you know it's, it's important to have D men that can can score, and, and that was happening tonight. That, that I mean, that's that's been you know one of the strengths that we've had to rely on the entire season is you know obviously we've got Shane there, and we have no um, you know issues with with how he performs on a on a consistent basis. But I thought our D have done a really good job, even when we were short, um, you know, in just keeping it simple. And they're really mobile; they can skate, and you know I, I think. Tonight and last night, um, you know, and, and actually the few last few games, you know, the job that Reese Cochran's been doing for you know for us and stepping in, you know, his confidence level is getting you know better game in game out, and uh, he makes mis mistakes like the rest of them, but I uh, thought, thought he he's handled himself uh, well um, the last few games, and for him it's really um, taking the next step and, and being consistent, you know, and that's that's I think uh, it's going to be good to watch. Next weekend, um, uh, we've got the stars in this building, and then your first look at uh, Sheffield away. Yeah, I mean, it's another derby game for us. Um, you know, I think we've got a team that, that can compete with anyone in the league. Um, we just need to make sure that we're consistent on a nightly basis, and um, you know, again, build on the hype, build on the excitement of, of tonight. Um, you know, hopefully we're all supported um, next week, um, and. Yeah, go about our business in the exact same way. And then Sunday, be a really good test for us. But, you know, like we went down to Nottingham yesterday and I thought that, you know, I thought we held our own really well. And, um, yeah, we can have to have that same effort intensity, uh, you know, uh, in Sheffield. Lots of support inside the building from the fans uh, and uh, and also online from uh, Kibilati's mom as well. So, oh, okay. well, so yeah. you please her as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah no, the, fan, the fans were great. And again, when you give them something to be proud and, and excited about, you know, and I think it started with work, work ethic tonight, and then you know, obviously the goals come after work ethic, and I think that, you know, if we can harness that, it's going to be a very difficult place for people to come. Um, you know, going back to a few years when 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 we were, you know, winning um, a lot in this building, and I think that's where we need to get to. Jeff, thanks very much. The Bay Hotel, where your dream wedding becomes reality. Visit us at thebayhotel.net.